Hello, hello, and welcome to the first installment of me reacting to my Mutuals Made content, where I so self-explanatory react to content made by the people who I know of in my personal life. Now, for the record, I won't out like any personal anythings, but it's just whatever they posted as public. Just so you know, it's a little, it's a little friendly reminder. It's not a threat or anything. And I've been contemplating on this series for a very long time, but fuck it, let's ski it. But of course, if you are mentioned and uncomfortable with whatever the hell I'm doing here, then feel free to PM me. Like, I know you, you know me, just LMK, okay? So, our first victim, because his EP comes out today, and I'm pretty excited, is Michael or Mikey Daniels. I'm sorry, but I don't know how to pronounce that. I'ma try anyways. Aaron's Day. Aaron's Day? Aaron's? Aaron's? I'm so sorry. Um, anyways. So, for context, I only ever met him once. And this was at a birthday party back in 2019, but we didn't talk about whose party it was. And I realized that this was like three and a half years ago. I remember him introducing himself, and although it was short, he is such a vibe. And I think he also slut dropped to the ground during that, but it's a slay. Ever since that, I think we're following each other on IG, the Grahams. And to my surprise, when I found out that this man not only sings, but plays the keyboard? I was like, no fucking way. And I saw it on Felicity's story where he performed with Angie, who is also her cousin, I think. And Angie went to the same high school as me, but she was in my sister's grade. So yeah, it's kind of crazy to think about. And Felicity and Michael, they're a couple of soul bonded besties, and I cannot stress on that enough. Like, it's kind of disrespectful if you think about one without thinking about the other as well. The same goes with Eden. I had to name drop them because it's mother freaking Eden on God's period. So the three of them are like a peas in the pod trio. But that's from what I've gathered on their socials. Again, I only met them like once or twice. I haven't watched Angie's and Michael's performance yet because I wanted to react to it as intended. But then like Michael dropped a hint and I was like, okay. <laughs> and then the trailer dropped for his EP. Excuse me. No need for concern. I'll make me love Um let me explain. I think it's because I had no idea what I was expecting. This is the first time I'm hearing him sing and play. Again, I've only met him once. And him doing both at the same time with an original piece. Like, I am set. And of course, Felicity filmed and edited it, naturally. Like, imagine you and your bestie combining both of your talents and passions to create a vision. Can't be me. Anyways, um, back to the trailer. I don't know why, but at the start, I got like ice cream truck and nursery vibes. Like, I got nostalgia, especially when the keyboard came in and what an entrance it made. For some reason, and I feel like I'm the only one who feels like this, but it reminded me of today's the day the teddy bears have their picnic. I don't know why. Maybe because of like the melody-ish and he's all like snugged up in brown and like in the woods. Like, maybe he's the bear or like running away from them. It's probably only me who feels like this for sure. And then the little snippets. Oh my god. Like that build up right before he sings. But also when he does, I feel so conflicted because I finally get to hear him sing right. But the lyrics are giving melancholy. So I'm like, 
yes should i be happy or sad i didn't play like any musical instruments so please excuse my ignorance was it a bar? But from like what I've conceptualized, you kind of have to like slam the piano to invoke something. And I think I've heard it kind of like intensify as well, especially since it's in the lower range. Um, That's like the left side, right? I feel more so sad. And it's only the trailer. I know I'm overanalyzing the entree before the appetizer, but I don't know. I already felt so much within that minute. So um, it's now taken me a couple of rewatches, but I'm sorry, I still don't know how to feel about it. Anyways, he posted his EP on his IG story, so um, yeah. And sir, I see that bear. And what did I say earlier? Literally, what did I just- The cover is very on brand with him though. Very. So let's give it a listen. Ice cream truck. Did he add new sounds to it? Cause that like trample leading sound wasn't there in the trailer. What? <laughs> What's the concern? Haven't really heard. Pause, 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 pause. <laughs> I know it was just getting good, but um <laughs> Wow. His vocals. Um let's let's continue. Bro, what was that? Okay, okay. I can't. I cannot. The way he sang outstretched hands did something to me. And like, while we're on it, like, what was that small pause? That was something. Okay, sorry, continue. No, 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 you did not. You did not just do that. And it's so haunting. I can't, it's so haunting. Wait, is wait, is that going through my brain right? As if it's over. Okay, so that just happened. Um, no thoughts, but are you okay? <laughs> I'm questioning if I am overreacting because I seriously did not know what I was getting into. Like, I thought the trailer would be like a cut of the actual song, but no. You little leg puller. Just to reference, I don't watch like any or well, like listen to any like music trailers. Um, so this is all just new to me. Personally, I enjoyed it. I think it's a pretty solid first release. Again, I wasn't quite sure what I was expecting, um, especially since this all came as like a shock to me. And I haven't heard of anything like this song before. Maybe because I don't listen to this music and this was like self-produced. So it's all very overwhelming for me. Positive though, positive. Like as a fellow creative, you know I'd love to see it. And again, I need to home in the fact that I only met this dude once. Let me repeat myself. Once. Did I mention that I met him once? So not only is my jaw dropped, but it really makes you think about the people who are just like right under your nose. Like, do you get that? So hit that subscribe. No, I'm joking. Unless. But um, yeah, that's gonna be it from me. Now go stream it.